how are you? This is Dorothy Smith, your Close to My Heart representative, independent consultant. And I am just wanting to do a quick little video. I think that they were hungry when they were putting this catalog together. This is the Seasonal Expressions, uh, January through April of 2018. And uh, let me show you what I was, why I say that. They have a real cute kit paper called Gimme Some Sugar. And I mean, it reminds me of, let me come down a little bit, old days with checkered, checkered papers, checkered tablecloths, and um, cute little mittens and bowls and, and spoons and uh, it makes some cute scrapbook pages and some cute cards. So these cards have little thin cut cutouts that are a little hand mixer and measuring cup and salt and pepper and mitt. And here it is. I mean, this is like the cutest thing ever. If you can see all of those cutouts, here are the thin cuts. So you have a rolling pin, salt and pepper shaker, a mitt. I love this little hand mixer and a grater. And it has, <laughs> so you can make little punny cards. So it's like, you must admit you're the best or um, grateful for you, you're great. Uh, you always measure up, we go together. I mean, really, really cute, but I love those little things, but this is the thing that I have not seen before. Um, and it is called, you know, I kind of like these cut above things. So this is a cut above. It's called, um, it's called Kitchen Traditions. So there, there is a Kitchen Traditions um, recipe kit that includes recipe cards and uh, divider pages and sticker sheets and then um, there's also a kitchen a cut above kitchen traditions bundle that has all of the um, memory protectors um, kitchen uh, I mean the uh, recipe cards divider pages and it all comes with a bundle and it also comes with the pretty pink album um, that is the Everyday Life album. So that whole six by eight thing. So here is kind of a close up of the memory cards and the divider pages that you get with tabs. So you can set up a uh, recipe book with um, holding the four by six recipe cards plus the divider pages to separate from entrees and uh, cakes and cookies, uh, that kind of thing. Plus, there is the most adorable um, stamp with a uh, little a turkey and a pie and a pizza and a soup and a knife, fork and spoon and a birthday cake and anyway, so that you can mark your recipe cards. So I thought, okay, that's, I want to do that um, for my son to pass down the recipes that I cooked for him while he was growing up. And so I went ahead and ordered this. So I am just going to unpackage my kit. I'm not going to write out any recipes here, uh, but I want you to see what's in this kit. And I got the whole bundle which of course I didn't bring my pink album with me because Lord knows I'm always going to forget something. So here is the opening page and it shows you how to make, you know, tips about the divider pages and how to make a little um, table of contents and then title card tips um, to kind of label the cards on one side and filling out the recipe cards um, on the other. Um, and then you've got also overflow card tips. So, you know, many of us have long recipes that take up um, a full 
two cards. Um, so you have overflow cards. And then also the thing that is so nice about this is they have journaling. Like uh, one of the stamps is the story behind this recipe or our family tradition. And you can put pictures in here. Like if I have um, my mother's recipe from making tomato sauce, um, you know, I can put a picture of her in, uh, which, you know, I lost my mother a couple of years ago, so how sweet is that to have something like that? And you're passing it down to your children, so you're, anyway, I don't want to get choked up over this, but holy moly, I think it's a wonderful idea. Um, anyway, here are the tabs to put on the, the full page uh, dividers, the page dividers, and then you, of course, of course, you get stickers to, you know, make your cards even cuter. So they have, you know, here's an idea with a picture of, you know, a, a kid cooking with her mom, made with love. Um, the uh, title pages, the uh, separator divider pages, and then uh, a recipe with an overflow plus a picture or or a full um, two four by six cards that cover the whole recipe. So anyway, that's pretty much tells you how to do everything. So so here is the package that has the recipe cards. And let me see, I think that there are 60 recipe cards here. Let me look at my catalog again. I'm pretty sure it's 60. 64 by six recipe cards. So, and they're, you know, in, uh, they're pink and green, pink on one side, green on the, the other. You have a little place to put a stamp. Um, you have, here's your overflow cards. Uh, and of course the backs are adorable. And um, anyway, that's what the, and here's some titles for, okay, the next bunch of recipes are going to be, say, cookie recipes or whatever it happens to be. Okay, so those are the recipe cards. And oh, we'll just put those over there. Here are the divider pages. So um, those are real cute. And then you have kind of, oh, look at this. This is so cool. Look at this. It's a kitchen conversion chart. So you've got meat temperatures, um, gallons and liters and ounces, and uh, 40, 946 milliliters makes two pints or one quart. Um, anyway, uh, teaspoons and tablespoons. So that's wonderful, and I, I still refer uh, to those things when I'm cooking, even at the age of 67. And here are the stickers for the dividers, and here are some of the stickers, just, you know, for fun, a spoon and a spatula. Love the little apron. Anyway, those are just too cute for words. And then... Okay, so we've got the four by six. We've got lots of them. Let me tell you how many they are. There's one, two, three. Whoops. Three packages of four by six. So that's 30 pages to hold 60 cards. And then you've got your divider pages, and there's one, two, three, four, five, six divider pages. And then here is the stamp with um, a pie and a cupcake, and it says, a dash of love, a pinch of sugar, lots of spice, and the story behind this recipe, this recipe reminds me of, I love this recipe because our family tradition, made with love, 
little jar and a little loaf of bread. Little fish means too cute for words. So I am just going to absolutely love putting together, and it'll take me, you know, it'll take me a while to pull out my old recipe cards that are, you know, have stains all over them from, you know, being used so much. And let me put you on hold for one second. Okay, back, because I always forget something. So here is the, and I haven't even opened it yet, but here's the brand new uh, color of the year, which is bashful uh, pink um, book to hold all your recipes. Um, anyway, I absolutely, I think this is a wonderful idea to do, you know, if you're a young mother starting out and you got your recipes and you have, you know, take pictures of you and your child cooking together um, and pull out pictures of your your aunts and your mom maybe your dad at the grill uh, cooking to pass down to your family anyway I just think this is a wonderful idea thank you so much close to my heart um, and the uh, I'll put the information on the YouTube page but um, if you just want recipe cards, you can order at Dorothy, D-O-R-O-T-H-Y dot C-T-M-H dot com. And the recipe cards with the uh, stickers um, and divider pages is Z4168. And if you want that with the memory protectors, it's Z4169. And you can look this all up. Um, when you get to my website, you can see it on um, under uh, kits. And the whole bundle, including the album, come is Z4167. So I think this is a wonderful addition to Close to My Heart. Um, and I really thank them for it because it would have been hard for me to come up with all of this uh, on my own. So thank you. Just wanted to share. Everybody take care. Make lots of good food and teach your kids how to do it. It's better to know what's going in your food than just getting something and you have no idea who's handling it or what's in it. And it's fun. Thank you. Bye-bye. Thanks for watching my video. Subscribe to my YouTube channel and visit my blog at dotscrapbooking.com.